I know it's, it's people that have left me comments and said, man, I needed to hear that. That's why I do what I do. It ain't even about how professional you are or how many $15 words you have. It's all about can people relate to you, you feel me? So what's up, y'all? We are back with another video, man. And today we are talking about how to be a patient father. So that is something that, you know, I've been working on. I'm learning a lot of my mistakes, which is making me feel like I can share something with other people. So I'm very impatient. Maybe I'm just a product of the times, but I want my stuff instantaneous. The hardest thing about raising a kid to me as an impatient father was all that crying. You'll be going crazy because you'll be like, I just fed you. I just changed the diaper. I, I gave you a bath. I'm nice to you. Why are you screaming at me, man? That's because it's a baby. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's a baby. That's what babies do, they cry. So, you know, if you are struggling with that, you know what I'm saying, or if you are very sleepy and you can't get no sleep because this baby gotta eat every five seconds, what helped me was somebody let me know that, you know, it's not forever. It's, it's for a couple months and then it get better. And that's the only thing I was holding on to. So I knew that every day I was getting closer to not having to suffer what I'm suffering right now. Conquer that time, you feel me? And allow it for now. But you know, understand that it's not forever. So just go through it for now. If you have to suffer now, suffer now. But you know, the reward, you know, is having a healthy child. And one of these days you're gonna you're gonna need that child to be patient with you. Cause you're gonna be old. You probably be sitting in the wheelchair screaming, ah, ain't no telling. You feel me? So be patient, you feel me? And do not abuse your kid. If you have to scream in the pillow or, or go for a walk or you know, count to ten or whatever you gotta do. Do that, you feel me? And even talk to other people that have kids because they've been through it too. And they'll be able to give you some game. Even um, doctors, when you, when you take your kid to the doctor, the doctor will be able to help you, um, give you some good advice. So be somebody that will listen to, you know, some advice. Like we love our, our wives and you know, you probably love your husband and whatnot. We're not used to having kids. It's a first time for every parent. When you have that first kid, that's your first time and you don't know what you're doing. So. Just listen to somebody that do have kids and don't listen to everybody because some people will tell you the mistakes they made and, and get you to do that. But, you know, it's all about love, peace and, you know, patience. You feel me? And understanding that it's, it's not forever. It's just for now. You, you ain't going to get no sleep all the time. You feel me? But eventually you will. But you got to earn that. Yeah, man, this video ain't going to be short. I mean, this this video is going to be short. This video ain't going to be long. So, um. Yeah, man, if, if there's anything that you can give the people that is advice as far as like how to be a, a good parent or a better parent, you know what I'm saying? Please leave that in the comments, man. Thank y'all for watching. Big Bro Ty with another video, man. I thank y'all again, and um, we out. Peace.